My sister, you oh have no idea. God. Have you ever wanted to be in one of these videos? I've dreamed of this my entire life. Wow, he said the ayah of the Quran as well. Ooh, you're not playing games. Which chapter of the Holy Quran is known as the mother of the Quran? That's correct. That's correct. MashaAllah. We pulled up to quiz random Muslims about Islam for an iPad. We're gonna ask them five questions about Islam, and if they get it correct, they're gonna win this iPad. Remember, if you want a part two to this video, I need you to smash this video with at least 20,000 thumbs up. Without further ado, let's get out over here and give out this iPad. First, what is your name? My name's Ubaidullah. My name is Ubaid. This is so cool, right? I'm, the signing, this is awesome. Okay. Rida. Rida. Dawood. Dawood. Areej. Areej, very nice to meet you. My name is, is Samaya. My name is Lena. Woo! <laughs> Abdullah. Abdullah. Uh, Ibrahim. Ibrahim. Abdullah. Abdullah, okay. Abdullah, okay, to Abdullah's, okay, that's an extra barakah right there. Extra a mercy happening right now. Now that the stage is set and we got Team Rida, we got Team Abdullah Squared, we got my biggest fan in the world, Daoud, and of course we have Team Obey the Law, who will be using ASL sign language with the student interpreter, Sumaya. So now it's your turn to guess in the comment section below who you believe will be the winner of this iPad. They haven't won it yet! But you know what? I feel the vibes. I feel the vibes. Inshallah. Inshallah. Oh! Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. A little accent. Inshallah. Oh! Alright, that's getting a little, a little, a little, okay. Now, let's begin. First question is this, Dawood. Which prophet was known as the friend of Allah. Ibrahim Ali Salam. Ibrahim. No, no, no. It's, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. You're best right. friend, Ibrahim Ali Salam. Yeah. yeah. I agree. Yeah. yeah. I'm going with them. Wow. No hesitation at all, ladies and gentlemen. Why so confident about that? Um, I just remember very well. I think. Mm. Is that how you do it? Now? Yes. Oh, Prophet Ibrahim. Khalilullah. 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 Ooh, wow, he said the ayah of the Quran as well. Ooh, you're not playing games. Abdul, Abdul. This is a high bad not one. Listen, 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 listen. Abdul, I, I think the real question I need to ask you is are you single, my friend? Jeez, that was uh, you can ask my parents. I'm, I'm going to stay Oh, that's even a better answer. Oh, that's an even better answer. MashaAllah, MashaAllah. Prophet Ibrahim. Prophet Ibrahim. Do you know what he's called in Arabic? Khalilullah. Khalilullah. My friend Dawood, you are getting that one correct. I think you knew that already, my friend. I said Khalil, but... Yes, Khalilullah. MashaAllah, sisters! Guys, this is not... There's no second guesses about this. You know that's the correct answer, all right? That's correct. That's correct. MashaAllah. Ma how, how do I sign MashaAllah? MashaAllah. MashaAllah. What a vibe. What a vibe. MashaAllah. That's beautiful. Wow, MashaAllah. All of our team seem to have breezed past the first question. But I want to give you watching a chance to win as well. All you got to do is type the answers to all of the questions in the comment section below. Five random winners will be selected for a chance to win an Amazon gift card. Now, on to question number two. All of them are going to help them, inshallah, okay? Uh, inside, how do you sign inshallah? Like this? Okay, guys, you know what it is? You know what it is? Oh, flick it, flick it, flick it, flick it. We got to flick, we got to flick, mashallah. Okay, this is so cool, this is so cool. Okay, okay. Second question, Daoud, you ready for it? Yes. Okay, inshallah, let's start it off. Which chapter of the Holy Quran is known as the mother of the Quran? You can help. I don't know. Maybe, but I actually don't know. Is that your final answer, that one? Wait, no, no, no. Wait. No, no, no. Surah Yasin is the heart of the Quran. Okay. So walk us through this reasoning that you're doing. So remember, Surah Yasin is the heart of the Quran, not... Or was it both? Oh, no. Do you know the answer? I'm debating. 
I'm thinking so deep back in. He's saying cha chapter. Oh, Sura. Sura, yeah. Oh, which Sura? Oh, yeah, this is. Okay. okay. Um, okay, so. Sura. Qalu Allah Wahad is worth a uh, third of the Quran. Oh, he, he, he asked about Umul Kitab. Yeah, yeah. Mother um, of the book. What do you think? I was I was gonna say Al Fatiha, but that's the opening. Okay, that's that's potentially one of the other names that it could be. Wait, did you say surah or just chapter? So surah, which surah of the Quran is known as the mother of the Quran. Try it. Try that. Is it Maryam? Maryam. Okay. So we have Surah Maryam, and we have what you're saying. And can I take a hint from him? So you're only allowed one hint. Only one hint. One hint. Hassan, hint. Is this Surah Fatiha? He's saying Surah Fatiha. Because you could do this, Dao. You could do this. You've narrowed it down to two things, okay? You're saying that Yasin doesn't make sense to you because you're saying that's the heart of the Quran, right? So where are you going with this? Mother. Okay, I think I'm going to go with Fatiha. Fatiha, final answer? Yes. So what did you guys, you know, delegate amongst each other? What did you guys think? Um, sort of Fatiha. Yes. Yeah, Surat al-Fatiha. Surat al-Fatiha. Surat al-Fatiha. No, we got it wrong, but... Keep it simple. I think it's... <gasps> it's simple? I think it's Fatiha. Okay. I'm gonna go with Fatiha. Man. I'm glad you didn't say with Yasin because that is the correct answer, my friend. Yes. You are now moving on to the third question. Yeah? Alright, al-Fatiha. <laughs> it's so interesting seeing you interpret exactly the signing that he's doing, this is incredible, okay? How, how do I say, how do, excuse me, how do I sign yes? Correct. That is correct. That is the correct answer, yes. Uh, is this correct? Like, if, if I, congratulations. I wish you guys would have listened to him because then you would have not walked away with this iPad right now because that was the correct answer, all right? I think I would agree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Agree? yeah, yeah. Well, I'm glad you picked the right person. That is the correct answer. It is Surah Fatiha. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Question number two was a bit challenging, but Alhamdulillah, all of our contestants were able to make it through. But be honest, how did you guys do at home? You just made me recontemplate my entire life choices. On that you have to, right? It makes you think that you should know what matters the most, right? right? Which is your deen, which is your faith. From what I remember, you're actually a fan of this channel. Yes. Correct? Yes. Have you ever wanted to be in one of these videos? I've dreamed of this my entire life. He's dreamed of this entire life. Now, he's young, okay? He has a long life to live. I, I you know, Inshallah. Inshallah. I want you to dream of better, bigger and better things than this, right? This ain't the highlight of your life. This ain't the highlight of your life, right? But this is going to be a fun highlight of your life, Inshallah. And he always wanted to try this. Now he's getting a chance at bath. So inshallah, let's see what you can do. Third question coming your way, you ready? Yes. How many times and at what locations did Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam see the angel Jibreel? Guys, before we continue with this video, I have to give a huge shout out to our partners, Qur'anli. Qur'anli is a state-of-the-art Qur'an habits building app. The way I like to look at it is as a Qur'an fitness trainer. This app with the correct intentions can help you develop a stronger link with the Quran using a whole bunch of different AI technology and neuroscience so that you can develop a more authentic link with the Quran. Just like me and thousands of Quran Lee's users, everyone seems to be not only benefiting from this app, but they're developing a stronger link with the Quran. So guys, please download this app for no commitment, no strings attached whatsoever. And if in the seven days, this isn't the best app you've ever used, delete it, no questions asked. But definitely a huge shout out to Quranly for our partnership. Without you guys, we couldn't be making these awesome videos. So Jazakallah khair. Now, let's get you back to the video. In its true, full, angelic form. So the question is how many times and where? Is that the question? How many times? So, um, I'm not 100% sure. I think it's, I think it's one time in Cave Hera, but I'm not, I'm not 100% sure. So one, at least one was definitely in Cave, uh, Cave Hera. Um, I'll give you that one. Definitely. You definitely have that. Yeah. Yes. You definitely okay. have that. So that's, that's correct? That's not the full amount of times, but that is that is one, one of the times. One, yeah. One of the times. Okay, so, but 
I mean, I have, this is so hard. I think it's only once one time. Once at Once, I, I think that that's, that's the answer that we should go with. Do you want to go with it? I'm not sure, though. Let him think. Take, nothing, you got time, right? We got time. Okay. I'm, I, I'm pretty sure it's once. I can, I can bet that it's once. I know one for sure. One to keep. Yeah, I don't know how. Do you, wait, second time? Maybe when he was making the Mirage? I do remember. Then the Mirage? The second? Yeah. And then... And then... Uh, is there another one? I... Those are the only two I can think of. Yeah, I just remember two. I don't know. What if there's a third one? I think one time in Cape Hedda, I'm not sure though. Wait, no, wait, no, no. He saw him in, uh, um, he saw him in the uh, um, Sirat, uh, Sirat, um, uh, Isra Mi'raj. He saw Angel Jibreel Isra Mi'raj. Um, he saw him in Cape Hedda, but that's, I don't know if that's any more. I don't know if there's any more. I don't even, I can't even come up with an answer. Oh my God. Want to give me a little guess or something? Is there a hint? I'll tell you this. The hint is he came in the form two times. Two times. Okay. You already got one. Yeah, okay. You need the second. Okay. Uh, so. He... See how nice I am? I'm giving him hints <laughs> and you, stuff like you, that. I'm giving you. him hints. I want him to win. Okay, that come on. Come on, buddy. Okay, so he, he came two times in his true angelic form. True angelic. Came one of those times in Cave Hill. And the. I can't think of any other time he was even yeah. Yeah. When they, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the only time that it came back and said Zamiruni, Zamiruni. Let's go with that. Let's go. I feel like you have an answer, fellas. Okay. Mashallah. Talk to us. Talk to me nicely, man. Got this iPad. I really want you to win. You know what I mean? So, what were you guys thinking? Um, we know the place, Ghar Hira. Ooh, okay. Um, he's seen him and once at Ghar Hira. I'm gonna say he came both of his, the both two times in Cape Hill. Is that your final answer? Yes. So say the number of times. Two. Two times. And what were those two times? Um, once in the cave when there, yeah, and then the second mirage when he was making the mirage, and then because I remember he Jibril Islam was with him, and then he asked questions like he was like, who are these people? Who are these people? And then he was telling him that you know the, these are the people who did this or did that. So I I, I do. Two times. Yeah. One was in the cave, Revelation. Uh -huh. The second time is Sirat and Mirage. Yes. So you're saying two times, and you said the location. Yeah, Sirat and Mirage, and then a cave Hera. Fellas, unfortunately, that's not the correct answer. Oh, boys, boys, boys. Let me just tell you this, though. You definitely got one of them correct. But here's going to be my hint. And I want you to do the research about this. And I want you to hit me up with an answer. And I'm going to send you guys some Amazon gift cards, OK? Find out how many times that this happened. Dawood, I'm so sorry, but that is not the correct answer. I'm so, so sorry, Dawood. You played an amazing game, my friend, but unfortunately, you did not win this iPad, okay? But how about this, man? Once you find the answer, hit me up directly, okay? And I'll hook you up with an Amazon gift card. Thank you Okay? So love, man, love. My sister, I want you to keep holding this because that is the correct answer. MashaAllah! MashaAllah! My sister, you have oh no idea. God. And hey, smash that thumbs up button just for these two who are eating this delicious ice cream the whole time. I mean, look at them. MashaAllah! Lena just got you past the third question. That is correct! That is correct! MashaAllah! 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 Oh no. Guys, unfortunately, Team Abdullah squared, and the person that I was personally rooting for, Dawood, were unable to answer the third question. However, we got Team Rida, and we got Team Obeidallah, and their entire sign language crew ready to win this iPad. Things are getting closer, things are getting tougher. Let's jump into the fourth question and see what happens next. At which of the obligatory prayers do the angels that are assigned to mankind assemble? I have a guess. Fajr? That's, that's your guess? That's my guess. Okay, we'll see what's happening here. Um, my, guess is, my guess is that it's on the last 10 days of Ramadan. Oh, okay. Oh, he said that. 
which is a fard prayer, Salat al Fajr. It's either Fajr or it's Asr because Asr has a lot of importance too. So it could be either of them. Now, Fajr or Asr? Um, Who are you looking at? Huh? Who are you looking at? Okay. Okay, don't be looking over there. Okay, we watching everything. I got eyes, sister. I got eyes. All right. Ramadan, there's no Fard prayers. Tahajjud and Qiyamul Layl and Taraweeh are all Sunnahs. So they wouldn't be counted as obligatory prayers. Okay? So it would have to be one of the five prayers. Fajr, Dhuhr, Asur, Maghrib, Isha. And I'm gonna say it's Fajr because the angels descend in that. That's like a very important moment where your where your where your du'as are accepted during Fajr. So I just wanna say that I'm absolutely so proud of you on how it's not even me, you should be proud of yourself because your parents are doing a good job raising you, you know, and they're, you know, and you're just here showing the knowledge that you have, and it's not about answering this or the, an iPad, that's just a thing. The fact that your, your, your dean is there, that's what matters the most, okay? So, Fajr or Asr? Guys, what do you think? Any clue? Do you feel the same way now? I feel like it's Fajr. You think it's Fajr by yeah. itself? What do you say? Are you saying it could be multiple? Are you, you're asking, can it be multiple? I never said it couldn't. You're saying Fajr, you're also leaning towards Asr. Yeah. I'm not telling you that it can't be multiple prayers. I just want to no, be clear. No, I think it's either. It definitely is one. It's definitely one. Yeah, but I just don't. I, the only reason I'm thinking Asr is because Asr has a lot of importance it's in the middle of the day and it's emphasized. So, yeah, and Fajr, of course, it's like, it has to do with like, you know, your dedication. You have to wake up, make wudu. So, uh, I'm very close, guys. What do you think? What are you leaning towards? Fajr or Asr? Uh, between the two, I would I would lean towards Fajr. So in my Athkar book, there's like a time where you make your Athkar, which is like between like as like between Asr and Maghrib. So I think that's like the time, Asr the time. F Fajr, 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 Fajr. Fajr, you unlock it. Lock it in. Final answer. Final answer. Really? Yeah. All right. Sure about this. Once you lock it in, you can't undo it. Sister, this is for an iPad. I just want to be clear over here. This is for an iPad. Yeah. Am I? Am I though? Am I though? Um, yeah, Fudge. Fudge? I think. I'm sorry, my sister. That is not the correct oh. answer. Okay, final answer. Fudge and Austin. That is the correct answer, yes! Yes! yes. Alhamdulillah! Alhamdulillah! How do I sign Alhamdulillah? Oh, I love this. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice. The reason is, because that's the partial answer. It's Fajr and Asr. Both. I was at the right track! Oh my god! Both Fajr and Asr. That's why I kept on saying, and I emphasize prayers. Oh my oh prayers. You were right about it being Fajr. multiple. Yeah, I that's, that's why I kept on coming yeah. back to you. You're like, you know, <laughs> things. So the messenger saw some tells us that there's a shift of angels who come to us, right? Uh -huh. So the Fajr angel stays with you all the way until Asr, and it reports back to Allah once it's relieved of the other angel. The other angel relieves it of his duty, and then goes, it changes shifts. And it goes back to the heavens and tells Allah. Allah asks the angel, what condition did you leave my servant or slave? It's going to say, I left him in a condition of prayer. And then when the other angel gets relieved at Fajr time, because from Asr to Fajr, it's a new duty. And Allah calls him back up. What, did, what condition did you leave him? They say prayer. So the mercy of Allah is giving us that the whole day, so you, like you were playing all day and night in prayer the whole time. So the correct answer was Fajr and Asr. Initially, I, was I got you were so close. So honestly, I was trying to be like, please, just pick both, please pick both. And you know, you had the hint from the brother already. Otherwise, I would have given you yeah, this yeah, myself yeah, yeah. right now. This is you all played a very, very good game. May Allah bless you all. I mean, I mean. And may Allah increase you. And great job that you're doing over here at the stall. And may Allah increase you. Guys, unfortunately, Team Reda was unable to proceed and move on to the fifth question. 
They played a great game and I'm so proud of them. May Allah bless them. However, Team Obey the Law is killing it. They are on the fifth and final question and we are ready to go to the fifth question. But before we go there, I just want to let you guys know that we have officially restocked the Zamzam water, this official authentic Zamzam that comes only from Mecca. We were able to import this in USA and in Canada. Okay, before this, the only way for you to get some Zamzam was by going physically for Umrah, but now you're actually able to just order it by just one click of a button. And I also want to give you a special promo code. Type in the word iPad for a $5 off coupon on your Zamzam purchase. Now let's move on to the fifth and final question. Fifth question, which companion fought against his own son in the battle of Badr? <sighs> the anxiety. It was his son Muslim or not? The son was not Muslim, that's why he fought him. Okay. Uh so this companion fought their son in the battle of Badr. Then, they, then the later the son did become a Muslim. Oh, okay. No, no, no. Why, why do you mean to say? Was it Muslim? No. Omar wasn't Muslim. Wait, was he? Yeah, of course. All of them were fighters. No, they but had like to. Omar specifically. I feel like he. Like, he did he have that. a son? Wait, Abu Bakr. Let's, no, no. Let's actually. Why are you leaning towards uh, Abu Bakr? Man, I gotta. <laughs> So, um, the, this companion, um, so this companion, did they like, were they like one of the four Khalifas? Yes. Okay, that narrows it down. Thank you. Okay. Oh, okay. So we have, we have Abu Bakr and then we have Omar, Omar Uthman and Ali. So it's not Ali. Oh, Ali was young. I don't it's think it's not, Abu Bakr. Um, it's, so. It's Abu Bakr. No, it's, Can I have a team discussion? That's what we're doing. Can I, have a I think Abu Bakr. He's saying, okay, so listen, he's signing, saying that he, he believes that it's Abu Bakr, right? Let's go into this huddle really quick, as well. No, no, let's not go into the huddle. They need to see the huddle. Okay. They need to see the huddle. Okay, fuck back. Deaf people invented the huddle. Whoa! Fun fact to me. Final answer, let's lock it in. I, I, it's, it, I, I, I'm going to say Abu Bakr, I don't think we have a, a second option that we're feeling this strongly about. I think we should just go with the one that, you know, Everyone's kind of thinking. Obey the law. Obey the law. You played a really good game. All of you, actually. Sister Lena, you did a great job. Sister Sumeya did a wonderful job interpreting, signing for us. I wish that you would have just maybe used one of the other answers. But if you would have done that, it would have been the correct answer. That is the correct answer! You just won the iPad! You just won the iPad! MashaAllah! 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 This is because of my team. This is because of my team. Yeah, let's go over here for a second. Really? I don't have, I wouldn't have been able to do any of this without my team, without their help, so that's why we were able to do it. Obey the law. Obey the law. Are you saying the most important part was your team? Right, exactly. Teamwork. Yeah. That's exactly what it is. So, Sister Lena, could you come here for a second? I'm going to be between you and Sister Sumeya. Okay, could you come uh, here for a second? You're right. You guys were the most important part. Sister Lena, where are you? You're not walking away empty handed. He used your help so much. Oh my God, I lost my phone today. You got a much bigger phone. That's a big iPad. Yeah. Thank you so much. No problem. No problem. No problem. No, you. He obey the law. Couldn't have done this without you. Yeah. This is so crazy. I've never had anything like this before. Mashallah, Oh my God. I'm so happy right now. Thank you guys. Oh my God. And of course, none of this would be possible without Sister Sumeya. So Sister Sumeya, here's an Apple Watch for you. 
That's his Apple Watch for you, my sister. You did a great job. Obviously, everyone participated, everyone helped, but the most amount of interpretation of sign came from you. The most amount of help came from you. And obey the law, you just won the iPad. Honestly, guys, seeing you all who are fans of this channel and wanted to be a part of these videos makes my day. Honestly, I couldn't do this without you guys, and I am forever grateful to Allah for such a beautiful audience and beautiful participants. And remember, if you were playing with us at home, share your five answers. Make sure you didn't cheat in the comment section below for a chance to win an Amazon gift card. We came through over here, gave some dawah, did some Islamic trivia, but most importantly, celebrated the knowledge that you all had. I'm very proud of you all. Go have fun. Thank you. Right? And I appreciate everyone for watching. Of course, of course. Allah, play it on. Amin, amin. And your channel and everything. And may Allah make you successful. Amin. Could you also tell them to subscribe? Yeah, what channel? Subscribe, like, comment, turn on post notifications, do everything, send him money. <laughs> <laughs> All right. With that being said, thank you so much for participating. Thank you. Allah bless you. Alhamdulillah. Bismillah. Assalamu alaikum.